Hello everyone, welcome to another video and we're going to be back here today with a Age of History 2 video and we're going to be back with this part 2 of finishing creating the Soviet Union. So let's get into the game. So here we are now back into Age of History 2. As you can see, let's zoom out. As you can see now, we have taken down here and part of Asia back into the Soviet Union or into Russia for now and then the Soviet Union. And now we just have to take from Europe all here and we've done the challenge in creating the Soviet Union. So let's get into it. So first, all we're gonna have to do, what we're gonna do is first attack Ukraine, then Moldova, and then after I finish that, we're gonna go take on Belarus, Poland, and Lithuania. So let's get into it. Here we are now. Now we're ready for the fight against Ukraine. And now we can go and declare war on them. Let's get into it. Okay, here we are now. We've taken over Ukraine now, and now we're going to go do the peace negotiations to take the land that was part of Ukraine and now 
belongs to the Soviet Union. So let's get into it. Here we are now. Now we've done the peace talks with Ukraine. And now I have some provinces that are not part of the Soviet Union, which I'm going to go and give back to the other countries that originally had it. So I'm going to be bringing back Hungary and giving one piece of land to Slovakia. There we go. Now I have completed that task. Now I'm off to declare war on Moldova after I do the province stabilities. Okay, now I'm ready to go and fight Moldova. Now let's get into the declaring war on Moldova and bringing them back into the Soviet Union. Let's go. There we go, now we've taken all of Moldova. And now they are part of the Soviet Union. Now we're going to go and declare war on Poland because I think that will be the hardest one to attack as they split into two. So we're going to attack Poland first and then take the rest of Slovenia, which will be Belarus and Latvia. So let's get into it.
Okay, we are now ready to declare war on Poland, but as you can see, Poland is now ranked number three in the world, and it'll be very hard to attack them. So I will be asking other countries to come forward and help me in this battle against Poland. So let's get into it. Okay, that's all that I need from Poland for the Soviet Union, and let's go to peace negotiations. Poland has accepted our peace negotiations, and now... Let's get into the province stability. There we go, now we've done the province of Burdi, and now we're going to prepare for war against Lithuania. Here we are, ready for the war against Lithuania, so let's get into it. Here we go, we've now taken over Lithuania, let's go for the peace negotiation. There we go, we have now taken Lithuania as our own. Now let's go check what, what we need now to create the Soviet Union. It looks like all we need now is Belarus to take. And we've got back the Soviet Union. So let's get into that one. Here we are now ready to take on Belarus and complete the Soviet Union. Let's get into it.
There we go. We have now taken over Belarus. And let's go for peace negotiations. And here we are. Let's go do the province stability now. And now let's go and form the Soviet Union. Here we go, and guys, we have now finally form the Soviet Union after making this second video, making it into two parts because the first one was too long. <clears throat> and now here you can see the whole Soviet Union. So thanks guys for watching this video. As you can see, we have completed the Soviet Union. Hope you enjoyed this video. Leave a like, subscribe if you're new, and I'll see you guys next time. Comment below what comment below what you would like us to do in our next challenge for age of history. And we'll see you guys next time. Peace. Catch ya.